Brian King, UK Floor TV. Uh, we're in Grimsby at RWS Carpet Fitter Supplies. Um, uh, we're with Dan Jones and uh, we've, uh, we're with Josh Burton as well. Josh is called in to see what's going on. How are you doing, Josh? You all right? Not bad, thanks to you. Yeah, yeah, not bad. Well known face on the, uh, yeah. the forums, Josh. So, good, <laughs> good to finally meet you, to be honest. You too, yeah. Yeah, yeah you're, you're local to this, aren't you? Yeah, not too far, yeah, not too far. So hopefully, be back again soon. Oh, yeah. um, Pick, pick some more bits up. Uh, we're, we're doing a tool giveaway. Uh, we're giving away the uh, Roberts Concrete Grinder. Uh, Roberts have kindly donated this uh, and Steve at AWS. Uh, so if you uh, if you like, share and comment around that, your name will go into a hat and next week we'll we'll just draw a name out and that'll get sent to you. So we're getting better prizes, better and better prizes, aren't better we, all prizes, the time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the industry's looking after us, which means everyone else gets some off it, doesn't it? So. Well, we did the review on the uh, the yeah. long neck jam saw and uh, Roberts have sold quite a few. Seemed to go down yeah. well, that, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we did that at Harrogate. Um, that went down well, so we got, we got the concrete grind here. Um, 240 machine this is what 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 benefits benefits do you think that would give well for the obvious in little little space josh have you got a grinder um, i have i've not got one of the smaller ones but i've got one of the big um uh it's like stand-up machines how do you go on in smaller ones like tall ones things like that <laughs> struggle yeah uh, <laughs> that'd be definitely useful and right up to the edges the one I've got, um, I know some of the machines you can swing the, swing the big head on. The one I've got, you can't, you can't get quite as close to the edge as you yeah, might like. Yeah, so this... So you, obviously that, you're right, yeah, right and up you can, to the edge. You can slide this part back. That way, yeah, sorry, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, it's really easy to do. <laughs> when it does slide forward, here you are. Go on, Josh, fix that. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. So, so you can withdraw that. You still could push it against the skirt, and so you do have to be careful. You you can rest it on the, the tip of a bit of the shroud, but it's got dust extraction. The box in it has got we've got an adapter there to suit your Hoover, and there's a spanner in there to put the disc on. Feels nice in the hand as well, to be fair, doesn't it? It's nice and small, isn't yeah. it? Obviously, you wouldn't hit great big jobs with that. Um, no, you wouldn't want to be. I think we did say it was 1100 watt or something like that. Um, but it's got a diamond disc on it, diamond cup disc there. You can probably fit other discs on it, but you'd re remove your latency, paint, splatters. You could probably take a little ridge or a hump out the floor. What do you think, Paddy? What else would you use that for? Get your latency, get your paint off, won't you? Yeah, just knocking high spots off and things as well. Yeah. It's just another it's addition to, to your normal yeah. ground. And, and as you say, in a bathroom. That's ideal, isn't it? Or in a small area that you can swing that around with you, and it's not going to take the pan out or anything. I haven't got one, but I'm sure people who have got one will, uh, will, yeah, will, will comment. It. It's an handy tool to have. It's a powerful machine. It's got the adjustable handle on it. You know, it's like a normal angle grinder when you push that to lock the blade to undo it. Um, but yeah, a, a powerful tool. The thing with the Roberts stuff, I find as well, it's value for money. Roberts is yeah. You, you buy something, it, it, it's industrial, it does the job, but it isn't stupid money. The £149 plus VAT. Yes. Yes. So, so it's not that much money in the grand scheme of things, is it? No, and if you do want one and you don't win it, uh, RWS supply and, yeah. and, the, and the in stock. So. When you look at the price of the diamond discs alone, yeah, exactly. Yeah, you're, you're 150 quid as soon. Yeah. So we yeah. yeah. with the, yeah. the discs. Oh, uh, I'm a big fan of Robert's stuff. Are you, bro? Yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, I've got quite a, yeah, quite, I've a got quite a few looking up there. I've got quite yeah. a few of their, their bits. Yeah, it's stuff you collect up and then you suddenly realise that half your tool bag is Robert's. You, yeah. didn't, you didn't yeah, specifically go out to get it. Yeah. But yeah. 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 But yeah, if you want to win the uh, concrete grinder, um, like, comment grinder and share the post. And, uh, we'll one of the days, names. one of the days we'll get one going on the floor, won't we? Because I, I think what we did at Harrogate when we started it up with the jam saw and we used it, that promotes a lot of interest. Yeah. It's, it's better than just waving it around in, in midair, isn't it? Well, we don't want to start grinding uh, yeah, Steve Shannon in the floor, do we? It won't work well on carpet tiles. <laughs> Anyway, Josh, thanks for joining no us. No problems at all. Cheers, Dan. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. Yeah.